Lake Michigan is the deadliest Great Lake. Each year, dozens of people drown while swimming or boating in its waters. With no lifeguards on most Lake Michigan beaches, it's vital that swimmers and boaters know how to stay safe. If you're in the water of the Great Lakes and you're wearing a life jacket, you have less than a 1% chance of drowning. If you find yourself caught in a rip current, fight your body's instinct to panic. What we advocate is if you're ever struggling water over your head is that you flip, float, and follow. So you flip over on your back and you float, float to conserve your energy, and then follow a safe path. Swim parallel to shore and then back to shore. Piers are popular landmarks, but they can create dangerous currents. When they get to the pier, it's going to be like they're on steroids. They're going to be you know, twice as strong. There's waves bouncing into the pier. It's like a washing machine, and it's one of the worst case scenarios a person can get themselves into. If you see someone in trouble, throw them something that floats and put on a life jacket before you attempt a rescue. Many would-be rescuers become drowning victims themselves. I think you just got to realize that water is one of the most powerful energy forms there is. Water always wins.